Mendoza from Fantasy's Hair Salon and today I'm going to share with you some tips and techniques on how to do a bubble ponytail. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to grab a low ponytail and depending how long your hair is, but I suggest that you create it as low as possible as you can. That way your bubble ponytail can just have more bubbles along the way. So I'm going to smooth it with my fingers slightly. It does not have to be perfectly neat. And I'm gonna tie it right at the back of the head. I'm gonna stretch my pointy tail out a little bit. And I'm gonna start lightly teasing by dividing my pointy tail in about two or three sections. And I'm only gonna tease for about half an inch down my hair strand from where the elastic is. Now taking your clips down, we're gonna kind of smooth that teasing section to assure ourselves that we don't end up with any lumps in our hair. And we're gonna hold about two inches down from our hair tie. And this is gonna be the first bubble we're gonna create. And we're gonna tie that with an elastic. So I have a plastic elastic and this tends to just hold the bubble more into place uh, without such a big point tail holder like the one I used on the top. So I'm just going to tie this right here. And I'm going to stretch this out a little bit. I'm going to do the same thing on the next section. So if you have layers, some layers will end sooner than the others. Um, that's okay. You continue on until you can with the other hair. So continue on teasing from both the front and the back. Hold up with a clip. Bring some of the hair out with your fingers. So each bubble can be about the same width and length. And the hair spray the hair down a little bit. And now I'm just going to smooth. Awesome. I'm Linda Mendoza, and I just shared with you some tips and techniques on how to do a bubble pointy tail. <laughs>